Hi guys, this is Alan from Screenage. Well, after a few years, so, so many clients sent me the question and uh, confusion, asking me, hey Alan, what is OpenSale? What is the difference between OpenSale and a traditional LCD module product? What is the price? Why the price gap is, is big? And uh, what is the advantage for the OpenSale? So many pro questions if comes from them. In order to save the question and give the answer to all of our clients just for one time to make everything clear, so that's the reason why we came to here. This is our supplier for the open sale product workshop. And uh, from this line, you can see they're already doing some assembly. But the assembly they're doing is for the front frame. We call it front frame. It means the aluminum frame and the temperate glass. We can see this side all here are different the size specifications, temperate glass. Well, definitely for sure, that one is for the kiosk. This one is for the wall mounted and this one is for the wall mounted too. But the most important for the open cell is how they do the assembly and how they make it as a display, as a product can competition compared to Samsung, LG, AU, or, or some big factories. The key or the secret actually is inside for the dust-free workshop. Let's go to see what's happening there. So here is a dust-free workshop. And uh, this area is the area to load the front frame. We can see here are some monitor front frame and the kiosk front frame. All the front frame has been assembled in the first place and then they will transmit to this place. After that, they will put the product front frame to this plate and then the product will send inside the dust free room. So, I also want to know what's happening inside there. Let's go together to explore that. For the open cell dust free uh, assembly workshop actually is very, very strict because we must follow the rule to ensure it will not, there is no dust between the display inside. So we have to wear wearing the uniform. Ah. Mm -hmm. This is a hat. Mm -hmm. Uh, my head is too big and I feel the head is a little tight. <coughs> or after that, I also have to put this on my shoes. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Actually, it feels so weird when you inside a such small sealed space. Oh, that is in my mind. Uh, asking me to turn around. Okay, finished. Then I can get in. All right, let's wait a moment. Let's wait for my friend, the guy who holds the camera to do the same thing. <laughs> now here, guys, you can see, the, that is the interface for the control center. Every person get in must go through for the 10 seconds, strong 
airflow. Whew, finally, here we are, really not easy. Let's look that side, what they're doing. Okay, we can see these people, they uh, clean the front frame because they must do that very carefully to ensure there is no dust would be get inside. And actually before the product comes in, inside it also has a film. So what are they gonna do inside is they will remove this film and then to clean that. After that is go for the sec next step. So they will turn it over and then to check if everything okay on the front of temperature glass. Is that any rubber or any draft or any scratch on it? Actually, this is easy. Still did not reach the key point. How we make the open cell. Right now, follow my step, come to here. When we're talking about the open cell, actually, this is the real open cell we are talking about. This is the open cell from the original manufacturer, like Samsung, LE, or AUO, or BOE. Okay, thank you. So, uh, I must be very careful. And I cannot press this button because if I press this button or the open cell will drop down and I gotta pay. So <coughs> from this lab, I can realize this is a 32 inch open cell comes from BOE. And actually it's a, seems a very slim glass, but very important part are uh, these two PCBA because they're gonna get a contact to the monitor logic board. All these things will be control the uh, display, I mean, for the temperature, I mean, the display color temperature, copper, <coughs> sorry, for the color dips. Oh, one thing I have to mention. For the open cell product, when we're talking about what is a brand, LG, BOE, or AUO, um, actually, we are talking about the open cell brand, not others, just as the open cell brand. So, because for the rest of the things we're gonna do here in China for some workshops and <coughs> some of our partners, <clears throat> Another thing you have to be very careful when you buy the open cell product is you must uh, to mention to your supplier that I want to use, I must ensure use the A grade open cell because some of the factories, they, in order to save the cost of the production, they will use some, I mean, uh, B grade open cell to put inside, that will be very, very bad. So let's check what is this gentleman he is doing. <clears throat> he is doing the middle frame. Assembly is a middle frame. I don't want to bother him, but there is a lady over there. He's doing the QC checking for his uh, middle frame. Let's see. After the assembly of the middle frame, so this is a place they are doing the checking. So you have to ensure there is no dust, no problem, no scratch, nothing on this side because the open cell will be put inside this part. So here is a place for he to check in, everything be perfect. After checking, and they will do this part, the, the middle frame will be put here, 
and uh, this lady is putting the rubber to the middle frame because the between uh, this plate and the open cell, they must have they it must have a gap between that. So let's go to the next step. What are they doing? Oh, they are trying to come to this side. Look at that part. You can see that guy is using a glue to seal the open cell, open cell with the middle frame together. Because of the time issues, well, we just mixed, actually, they just checked how is the middle frame looks like. One moment, please. I will let them turn it on. Hey, you can turn it on now. Can you turn it on now? From that part, we can see for the middle frame, actually it's empty, it's nothing. We just can see the backlight is pure white, nothing. No colors, no any images. But right now, when we put the open cell on it, then we can see it's showing something. For example, please come closer. On this corner, I can see 1448119. This is a magic part, actually. The open cell, it do not have any, I mean, do not have any light. But the middle frame do not have any color. But put them together. The magic things happens. We can see the images. So after this guy, he is doing the ceiling for his uh, middle frame and it's the open cell. Then they will move to another place. The reason why they put the glue to seal it is they must ensure no dust would get inside between the middle frame and the LCD open cell. After they sealed it, then they will come to this place. Well, they will put the metal plate to fix, to tighten it, to hold it in a more strong way. We can see here is a metal, metal plate with one, two, three, four, four screws on the long short, long side. Also, one, two, oh, one screw is missing, I think on the short side. This is just for the 32 inch open cell, but I'm, I guess in some big sizes like uh, 75, not bigger enough, 98, 104 inches, the screws will be more bigger. But for this part, already been here, actually, we can call it LCD module now because it's, it has everything. It has a middle frame, I mean, the one who can provide the light. It has an LCD open cell. So if we give the, if we get the flat cable, get a contact and get a contact here and another side, put the logic board on and also give the power to it, then this LCD module could light on. Actually, all the things we do here is to produce this kind of the LCD module. But why we call the open cell and uh, open cell digital signage and the traditional LCD module digital signage? Because when we call traditional LCD module digital signage, we buy this LCD module from LG, Samsung, or AUO. We not we buy the whole things from them, then definitely the price, the cost we have to pay is much. But if we do this in this way, we just need to buy the LCD open cell from them. So you know that in China, I mean, for the small workshop like us, uh, the labor fee, the management, uh, the, the cost is, we have not be that expensive. 
So this way is a way to save the cost for the whole production. All right, this is the whole place when we make the uh, LCD module, but what's next is we have to put this LCD module to the front frame. Like here, this gentleman, he already cleaned the front frame and then they will put the LCD module inside the front frame. Hold on, please. Let me carry that one. Come to here. Oh, no. Come to this side. Sorry. So I'm going to turn it over. Then you can realize it. You see? So we put the LCD module inside the in front frame. Then the product already finished at 90%. Actually, when we done this step, so one more thing we have to do, we have to put a metal plate to cover this area. Then we will put the product to that plate. So it will be sent it out. All right. So the report inside the dust free workshop is finished. Let's go to outside to see what we're going to do over there. Please follow me. <sighs> Actually, it's very cool here because the AC is on. So we can get out from this room. Uh, I want to remove my head because it's very hot outside. In order to save the time, so I will keep wearing the uniform because anyway, they're going to wash it. So from this point, you can see the back cover already on it. And then this is the open cell already being finished the whole, the whole production. After that, the product will do the aging testing. Like here, you can see this is the floor standing open cell already finished and already turns to the burning model. So we can see the red, the pink, the green, the blue color, but no images because it's a burning model. After that, doing the aging testing for uh, 24 hours, then they will send it back to our assembly workshop. We will put our motherboard, our control board, main board, and some board to, I mean, for that, uh, that can meet the requirements or, and the demand from the client. After everything, the whole production gonna be finished. Okay. I hope right now you can understand what is the difference between the LCD open cell and LCD module and what is the LCD open cell. So please feel free to contact us if you have any further question or doubt on the LCD open cell product. Please send the information or the message to our salesperson. We are more than welcome to give you the reply. Thank you. Bye-bye.